warm welcome to our TVET lecturers. I'm Amanda Skinner from Macmillan, and today I will explain the recent updates to the Mathematics N5 curriculum and show you how our excellent, approved TVET First Maths textbooks help you to implement the revised curriculum. Maths N5 is being implemented in August 2022. You will need the latest textbooks to teach the correct curriculum and prepare students for the exam. The logo, Revised Curriculum 2022, tells you this is the correct book. Later in the video, I will tell you more about the three TVET First Mathematics N5 textbooks approved by the DHET for the latest curriculum. These are TVET First Mathematics N5, TVET First Maths by Van Rensburg N5, and TVET First Maths N5 Students' Handbook. Let's start with unpacking the curriculum changes you need to know about. All of the learning outcomes have been renumbered and some of them have been reworded. Although the weightings have remained the same between the old and the new modules, there are now eight modules in the new curriculum, whereas the old one had six. This is because the content of the module on application of the definite integral has been divided up into three separate modules. These are module five, which covers the definite integral, module six, which covers areas and volumes, and module seven, which covers second moment of area and moment of inertia. Moment of inertia is also known as second moment of mass. These three modules on the application of the definite integral have not been given individual weightings, so their combined weighting remains the same as in the previous syllabus. The weightings of the other five modules are also unchanged. An important new learning outcome has been added to module five on the definite integral. Students now also need to be able to determine definite integrals with infinity as a limit. Many of the learning outcomes and teaching guidelines have been simplified or summarized. For example, the old syllabus gave detail on the steps involved in applying Newton's method. However, the new syllabus simply states that students should apply their knowledge of differentiation to Newton's method for the approximation of irrational roots. Other learning outcomes now have more detail. For example, in Module 4 on integration techniques, there is extra guidance in the learning outcomes on what these techniques involve and how to approach these kinds of problems. While the old syllabus contained a few examples to elaborate on the techniques, in the new syllabus, the learning outcomes for each module are followed by a learning content section, which contains detailed worked examples for most of the learning outcomes. Written assessment must include all the cognitive levels listed in Bloom's taxonomy. Lecturers need to include higher order thinking skills in assessments, such as analyze, evaluate, and create, in order to prepare students for the exams. That concludes the main changes to the Maths N5 curriculum. Now, let's look at three popular DHET approved maths courses from TVET First for you to choose from. I'm going to start with our TVET First Mathematics N5. This full color students book is a complete course between two covers. It has everything that your students need to succeed in their exams. This book offers language support for new concepts and important terminology, clear diagrams and graphs in full color, which make learning fun and more interesting, step-by-step -step strategies for problem solving, graded worked examples that progress students from basic through to engineering calculations, alternative calculation methods which support different teaching and learning styles, a wide variety of activities using exam type questions and real world scenarios, summaries at the end of each module for focused revision, and summative assessments at the end of each module for exam practice. No good course is complete without a lecturer's guide, and this lecturer's guide is the perfect resource 
for lecturers who want to focus less on preparation and marking time and more on teaching students and preparing them for exams. The guide saves lecturers lots of time because of the following features. The lecturer's guide provides a 10-week suggested teaching plan. There is a lesson plan template which lecturers can photocopy. There are comprehensive solutions to all activities and assessments in the student's book. Learning outcomes are clearly mapped to the student's book content. The book provides guidance on teaching and learning strategies. There are links to useful videos and online materials for students. And the lecturer's guide includes a practice exam and two class tests for exam revision, both with marking memoranda and analysis grids. The next TVET First Maths course I'm going to tell you about is Maths by Van Rensburg. Van Rensburg is a well-known and popular name among maths lecturers, many of whom have used his textbooks in TVET classrooms for years with great success. He has now updated this tried and tested series to meet all the latest curriculum requirements. Let's look at some of the features of Maths by Van Rensburg. It offers concise explanations, thorough examples and varied activities. Students can consolidate their knowledge through many activities and summative assessments. The textbook provides alternative methods for problem solving so that students can choose the method they understand best. The student's book includes a practice exam. The short answers at the end of the student's book allow students to check their work. And a bonus feature of this textbook is that it includes many enrichment activities, which encourage students to get a deeper understanding of the mathematics. Maths by Van Rensburg comes with a brilliant lecturer's guide, which has lesson plans, complete answers, and a memo for the extra practice exam. Maths by Van Rensburg is a great choice for lecturers who feel most comfortable with a proven textbook that they know and trust, for students who want to consolidate the basics of maths with concise explanations, for stronger students who would like to develop their abilities with extension and enrichment activities, and for students who wish to learn to apply their knowledge and not simply memorize it. I've covered Mathematics in 5 and Maths by Van Rensburg in 5. Now let's look at our third brilliant textbook, which is the TVET First Maths Students Handbook by the experienced lecturer Ivan Muppeling. The Students Handbook is a textbook that gets straight to the point with a hands-on practical approach. The Maths Students Handbook has a unique, simple, but effective three-step approach. Step one is to analyze the question. Step two is to select the correct method and tools needed to solve the question. And step three is to apply the method. Students are guided to apply these three simple steps throughout the whole N5 curriculum so that they learn to answer any problem correctly and easily. The student's handbook also includes full solutions at the back of the student's book, not just short answers so that students can check exactly where they have mastered the maths and where they still need further support or extra practice. Because the answers are provided, no lecturer's guide is necessary. Let's look at who the student's handbook is ideal for. It's perfect for students who are studying mostly on their own and who need everything in one comprehensive, hands-on guide. For students who are using another core textbook, the handbook provides extra practical application and hands-on techniques. It's ideal for students who want a significant leap in their results, whether they are aiming to go from a fail to a pass or a very good to an excellent. And finally, the handbook is first choice for lecturers who want to help students take responsibility for their learning. I have now taken you through the changes to the Maths N5 curriculum and demonstrated the features and benefits of the three approved courses available from TVET First. Look no further. Whatever your maths needs, 
TVET First has just the right textbook for you.